definitely auditioning. It's one of my OG list items. Star in a WWE action movie. I think I'm gonna pass. Are you kidding? Do I need to remind you that the rank and file films are cinematic masterpieces? No. You mention that every year on that weird holiday you invented where you binge all of them from start to finish. You mean Thanksgiving Day? It's the most heart-pounding, action-packed, explosive day of the year. And it's gonna catch on. You'll see. I wouldn't get your hopes up, all you wannabe movie stars. Because I already have the lead role of Bryce Decker locked in for the fourth consecutive film. I mean, do you really think the rank-and-file franchise could continue without the most accomplished WWE superstar slash actor in history? The answer is no, people. But please, feel free to audition for a bit part or an extra role. I'll be sure to put in a good word for you with the director. Gotta run. Getting my eyes bleached for the big shoot coming up. Really gonna make these baby blues pop on screen. Break a leg. Sorry, this isn't my thing, but I know how excited you were. Hmm. Honestly, the franchise is probably better off in the hands of a seasoned artist like The Miz. You were right. It was a stupid dream. <sighs> you know what? I changed my mind. Let's audition together. It'll be fun. Really? Yeah. Let's give it our best shot, and maybe we can get supporting roles, or background would be fine too, even deep background where we're out of focus and no one can see me. Oh, that would still be cool. And just imagine all the kids' faces when they see us in the movie next year on Thanksgiving Day. They'll light up with explosions and excitement. I'm still not sure that's catching on like you think it is. What is up guys, it's Will Linney here, but you can call me Dominic, we are back here with WWE 2K20 Micro Remote. So, it looks like we're about to audition for a movie role, it looks like. So, we can speak to Bianca Belair, or let's speak to Bianca Belair, I think that's how you spell her name. Instead of worrying about movie auditions, maybe you should focus on defending your Raw Women's Championship. Thanks for the advice, but I'm confident I can handle both. Maybe you feel that way because you've been facing subpar competition since you won that title last year. So how about you step up and take on someone who can actually challenge you? Who do you have in mind? Don't you think that was obvious that she was saying herself? Is that a serious question? I'm talking about the EST of WWE and that means what decline challenge accept challenge um I don't know actually do you wanna face her you know what Let's here's do my this. response with another EST for you no interest I thought that meant you were uh, I'm stupid. I thought that meant that uh, me and her were about to fight. What an idiot. Alright, let's speak to our troop. I don't know if you've heard, but there's auditions coming up for Rank and File 4, and I could really use your help. You've come to the right man. Not only have I starred in several movies, but it just so happens I'm a certified acting coach in over 17 states and three U.S. territories. Have you though? And what movies have you starred in? Because I don't think I've seen you in a WWE movie or any other movie. Sorry, but our truth. So is this one of the states you're certified to teach in? Sure. But before I green light your acceptance to my seminar, I need to know if you have what it takes to make it in Hollywood. So if you can beat me in a match tonight and then make three easy cash only payments of $99.95, we'll be in business, man. What, you want me to pay you money and beat you in the ring? I am not paying you On money. second thought, I think I'm just going to wing it. Me too. I agree. Okay. How about I make a one-time exception just for you and lower the payments to $79.95? Come on, that's a steal. Yeah, steal for my money. Sorry, man. I'm out. Fine. 
To be honest, I'm not really a certified acting coach, but that's how good of an actor I am that you believe me. So you're lost. So you're saying that I'm lucky I didn't pay you $99.95? Thank you, sir. All right. Okay, so let's continue story. Sorry, uh, but I'm just a little nervous with the star of the rank and file franchise here. Oh, don't mind me. I just wanted a sneak peek at what's going to end up on the blooper reel. You'll be fine. Besides, pressure makes diamonds. Or in this case, comedy gold. So I know you didn't give out script pages before the auditions, but when do I get to see the lines? You don't. Because you're going off book. I want you to feel it here by completely immersing yourself in the character. Now I'll read a line and you tell me what our hero's response should be. This should be good. Oh shit, I feel like I'm gonna fail this. <laughs> oh, here we go. The antidote is hidden in the vending machine, but it's jammed. Looks like we're gonna to I'm going to need to buy a lot of candy if we want to give sweet revenge. We're going to need a whole lot of quarters. Good thing my cousin Ace works at the arcade. I'll run into into it as hard as I can. And I know you haven't eaten in there, so I'll go try to uh let's get the uh, first one. Looks like we're going to need to buy a lot of candy if we want to get sweet revenge. Perfect! That's exactly what I was envisioning. Now let's continue. Are you sure though? Because I feel like you... I feel like if I pick any answer... I, I pronounced you dead a half hour ago, but we need to know where Donnie's gang is hiding out. Um, they hold up in Donnie's mum's basement, I know, because information isn't the only thing Donnie's mum plays fast and loose with. The real question is, what are they hiding from? Me or their guilt that they chose a life of crime over being good fathers? I saw it in a vision when I was dead. It's in a building that has a large white star on it. I saw your grandfather says hi and that he approves of your lifestyle. Let's go with that one. I saw it in a vision when I was dead. They're in a building that has a large white star on it. Also, your grandfather says hi and that he approves of your lifestyle. Yes! You absolutely nailed it! Beginner's luck! Okay, last one. Oh shit, here we go. The bomb is wired inside of Chloe's jet ski. So you're going to have to make a decision. Stay here so I don't get away or go save her and a bunch of innocent dolphins. What's it going to be? Um, dolphin noise. That's dolphin speak for both. The only th thing I love more than the bottom is bottom nose dolphins. Letting you escape is a... I'll, uh, no. I'm going to let you in a secret. Those are bomb diffusing dolphins, so the only one who's going to be sleeping with the fishes is you. Let's do that one, because that one sounds better. I'm going to let you in on a secret. Those are bomb disabling dolphins. So the only one who's going to be sleeping with the fishes is you. Brilliant! It's almost like you saw the script ahead of time. Unbelievable! Maybe you could play gang member number two or henchman number five. Not anyone with an actual name. <laughs> Thanks, Miz. You're a real... Yeah. Hey, okay, Miz. Now that Trey has dazzled me with his intuitive performance, it's your turn to audition. Are you kidding? This must be a prank, right? Did they bring back Swerved? No, this isn't a joke. But I'm the star of the rank and file franchise. You can't potentially recast me. I even have a Bryce Decker tattoo on my inner left thigh. I thought this so-called audition was just a part of your stupid hippity-dippity process. 
I assure you, it's very real. So if you're that confident in your ability, then please show me. Fine. But can I at least see the script pages? <laughs> that wouldn't be fair. I want you to feel it here. Don't touch me! Don't mind me. Sit down, shut up, and watch how a real Hollywood star performs this part. Proceed, director! The terrorists right, on, are miss. inside the arena, disguised as the opening band. You need to do something to stop them. We need to create a diversion. What kind of concert is this? Rock? Country? Hip-hop? I could really use some context. Don't worry about all that. Just immerse yourself in the character. Yeah, Miz. Immerse. Shut up. I think the only way we're gonna stop them is if we band together. Uh, puns are a bit too expected and broad for my taste. Too broad? A few minutes ago, this no-talent hack was babbling on about bomb-disabling dolphins. It rang true when he said it. Look, in the spirit of positivity, I think it's time for you to move on to a new artistic challenge. This is unbelievable. You'll be getting a call from my agent, my entertainment lawyer, and my regular lawyer. I actually don't have a phone, but I'd be happy to meet with them in person at my treehouse in the woods outside of Austin. Unbelievable! I'll call you. I, I just made up that whole treehouse thing to get rid of him. Brilliant. Well, that was actually pretty easy. I was expecting that to be hard. All right. Wonder if act. Yeah, let's move on. Before we get started, you should know, I'm just doing this to support a friend of mine, so I thought I'd just stand here for a couple of minutes so he thinks I auditioned. That work for you? Unconventional, but I like where you're going with this. Very avant-garde. No, you don't, you don't get it. I really don't want to part. The reluctant heroine. I dig it. No. I don't know how else to say this. I don't want to be in your movie. Sorry I'm late. The idiot I was sparring with accidentally scratched me, so I had to fire him. Then he started crying, saying how he couldn't believe his own daughter would do this to him, blah, blah, blah. What the hell are you doing here? Oh, hey, Red. That's the Didn't same question I was going to ask. Guess I just thought you were the director's homely assistant. His wife forced him to hire, so he's not tempted to cheat on her. Tried that. Didn't work. Why are you here? This is my turf. Believe me, I would have preferred to do this just about anywhere else, but I'm here because I'm using my MMA success to dabble in Hollywood. Kind of like Ronda Rousey did, only way better. Brooklyn's already been cast as our female lead, Miranda. You know what? Let's have the two of you workshop the scene where Miranda's daughter is kidnapped from the playground, and you're the stubborn crossing guard who won't let her cross the street illegally to chase after the kidnappers. Seriously? And... action. The kidnappers are getting away with Emily. I need to stop them. I'm sorry, ma'am, but I can't let you cross the street until the walk signal appears. I'm just doing my job. Yeah, well, a mother's job is never done. Going off script with the slap, but I like it. Use that anger, Red. If you ever touch me again, the only movies you'll appear in will be the instructional kind for plastic surgeons on how to fix faces that are bludgeoned beyond recognition. Maybe a tad extreme? Oh shit, we're gonna fight? Let's go. Cut, cut, that's a wrap. Oh, come on, let me beat her up. Let's go. Oh, let's go. Come on. Where's that? Thank you. Reverse that. Thank you very much. Oh no. Get off me. Hang it. Alright, good. And reverse that straight in your face. Jesus. She really has a temper, doesn't she? Alright, come on. Let's go. Stop reversing my move so I can get you to red health. Like your face is gonna be. Throw in the whiteboard. That's not the whiteboard. Dang it. Well, let's go. What are you. Why can't you hit her? Take her down. There we go. 
Is there anything I can use? The chairs, the camera pod, the camera? Nothing? Let's go. What is he speaking of? Are you kidding? So I can't hit there? That's stupid. Alright, nice neck breaker. Get her up. That's not what I wanted. Dang it. Let's go. Let's go. That's not what I want. Oh, I don't think I have my... Alright, what do I do? Uh, hit Brooklyn with your finisher. Let's go, Brooklyn. Come on. You reverse this. I'll be so upset. Super kick. Come on, you seriously tapped? And scene! Just like old times. <laughs> you can't be serious, right? You tapped out. Oh, Alright, let's move on. Despite Miz and Brooklyn doing everything they could to prevent it, I got the starring role in Rank and File 4. Red, on the other hand, wasn't so lucky. But I guess fighting with the lead actress during a casting session is generally frowned upon. Miranda, where are you? I'm in the spaceship's cockpit. Hurry, Bryce. We don't have much time before it launches. Your time's up, imposter. Cut! There's no henchman line in this script. You're just supposed to tackle him and then he throws you off the imaginary launch pad. Let's go again and this time stick to what's written. Sorry, but that's not going to happen. Oh! Security! Alright, let's go, Miz. Get him, Miz! I won't beat your ass again. Oh, I missed. Alright, let's go. Let's go, Miz. Drop him down. Let's go. Nice drop kick. Wonder if there is anything you can use here. The back wall, maybe? Maybe not. Okay, yeah, you can hit him on the wall. That's about it. Nice back suplex. What's over here, Miz? Oh, no. Ow. Nice neck breaker. Alright, what's over here? Huh? Wait, you can climb this? Alright, let's go. Oh, beautiful. Holy shit. Let's go, Miss, huh? You wanna go? Ooh, sledgehammer. Let's go. Oh, straight into the ribs, huh? Let's go. We want. Alright, I saw a table over here. Let's put you through the table. Not there, the table. Do I smell? Yes, I do. Best picture. Where are you going? Is there something over there you can grab? Oh, the bat. Wow, well, seriously? Grab the bat at least. So I can hit it with you. No. Nice cutter. Oh, yeah, that's right. My signature got reversed. Come on, hit him. I don't like that. What the hell is going on? Are you kidding? Come on. Who's cheering for Miz? Come on. What the hell's going on? Alright, there we go. I think Miz has a fan base.
Alright. What's this one? No, he reversed. Dang it. Come on. Get up. No, that's not what I want. Actually. Oh. Dang it. Alright, let's go there. That's not what I want. I'll pick him up. Put him through the table. What's going on? You gonna put him through the table? Come on, you serious, dude? There we go. Finisher. 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 This is the realest thing uh, I've ever seen. Dang it. Trying to do my finisher. Get off me, Miz. Dang it. Where we go? Oh. Why can you put me? Nope. Alright. Just put you through the table like this then. German suplex. Let's go. I always wanted to say that. I cannot work in these unsafe conditions. Then maybe you should talk to your friend, henchman number five. You started all this. You know what? I'm going to my trailer and I'm not coming out until you're recast. Don't look at me! Okay, that's lunch. How can you say that you can't work in this unsafe environment if you're a UFC fighter? That's what she is, right? An MM MMA fighter. Oh, well, let's move on. Miz, I appreciate you taking the time to have me on your show so we can set the record straight. Because the truth is, I shouldn't be here tonight in this crap basket of a town. No offense. I should be in majestic Vancouver, British Columbia, filming Rank and File 4. But unfortunately, my co-star, and I use that term loosely, let his personal feelings against my friend, The Miz, boil over. And now 200 crew members are out of work. That's right. I'm sorry to inform you that the production on Rank and File 4 has been temporarily shut down. And unless we come up with a solution, the shutdown could be permanent. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You're blaming all of this on me? I'm not the one who snuck on set like a crazy stalker and attacked the star of the movie. In fact, I have it on good authority from a security guard that you were the one who let Miz on set. So if anything, this whole mess is your fault. I would never do that to my crew. They're like family. Sure, I might forget their names or not let them make eye contact with me, but that's the exact same relationship I have with my siblings. Guys, guys, what if I told you I can make this act of injustice disappear without involving producers or agents or lawyers? How do you propose we do that? by settling who gets the part in a match at SummerSlam. But it won't be any typical match you've seen before. This will be an action-packed summer blockbuster. The rank and file four script will be suspended above the ring and whoever can climb a ladder and retrieve it first gets the starring role once and for all. This will be the premiere of the lights, camera, action ladder match. Sequels are tough to pull off. But me beating you for the part a second time is going to be way more entertaining than the first go around. And since we're in the spirit of making movie themed matches, I have another pitch for you. How about we give everyone a preview of the coming attraction to SummerSlam? Me and Red versus you and Brooklyn tonight on Raw. You'd all love to see me compete inside a WWE ring, wouldn't you? No. Well, too bad, because it's not gonna happen. 
I'm an elite MMA fighter and Hollywood star. This isn't my arena. Fair enough. But if it's not your arena, then why don't you get the hell out? I will not stand here and allow you to insult my esteemed guest. So, if you want a sneak preview match, then you got it. But it will be you and Red taking on me and my beautiful wife, Maurice. That's fine. Now that I'm a movie star, I get how it works. When it comes time for an action scene, you take out the lead actress and bring in the lower paid, less talented stunt double. As they say in Hollywood, ciao. I really don't want to do a mixed tag match. Serious? Oh. I guess we'll do a mixed tag match, I guess. Alright, let's go. Alright, the women's champion, Red. Let's go. Alright. Okay, here we come. Trey. Okay. Thank you. Alright. Wait. They don't come out together? Are you serious? That's ridiculous. They have a entrance, don't they? Okay, whatever. Alright. If there's no thing... Okay, never mind. I said if there's no thing to do, then I'll just skip it. But here it is. Boom! Let's go. Oh, Mr. Superkick into the gut. Knee to the face by Mar Maurice. That's ridiculous that they don't come out together. Oh, no. God. Get off me, Maurice. Let's go. No. Oh, yeah, I found out how to um, switch to your partner. You just press the um, touch screen button. As you can see, I'm doing. Um, look. Don't tag me in. I want Maurice. Dang it. Get off me. Dang it. Chop block where? Shit, I was not meant to do that. Jesus. Alright, come on. Get out. There we go. What do we do? Grapple. There we go. Body slam. Why don't we change corners? That's a weird way to pin somebody. How though? You couldn't even see anything. You just saw um, Brooklyn being angry. Okay, whatever. Alright, so sure, whatever. Let's move on. Alright, let's go. Alright, 
Let's go, Miz. Okay. Yellow health. Let's go. Oh, Mr. Dang it. Yeah, let's go. Come on. I uh, gotta get him to yellow help. Let's go. Boom. Let's go. Oh, come on. Let's go, Miz, eh? Nice elbow drop. Turn him around. Alright, gut wrench suplex. Here we come. Oh. Lift him up and drop him down. Alright, come on, Miz, let's go. Get up, yeah? Dang it. Let's go. Bop. Alright, what do we do? Corner strike. Alright, let's go, Miz. There we go. One. Two, three. Who is that? Is that Brooklyn? Yeah, it is. Oh, great. Let's go, Red. Right. Turn around, Trey. Turn around, try. Before he gets up. Throw him outside. There, yeah, let's go. Win the match by grabbing the briefcase. Let's go, Miz. Dang it. Alright. Let's go. Give me, get the ladder. Get the ladder then. Come on, come in. He's it back the right now. Oh, STO. Alright, let's set this up by hitting him there. Set it up. How the hell? Yeah, that's right. Get down, fool. Get the ladder. Oh, okay. He's going to get me before I get the ladder. There we go. Good. Let's go. Climb the ladder, man. I'll meet you up here. Oh, no. Oh, here we go. Come on, roll out, roll out. Oh, great, here we go. Oh, no, no. Get up. Get up. No, no. What are you doing? What are you doing? Oh. No, 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 no. no. He's going to win. He's going to win. He's going to win. Oh, great. What are you... Mm, fuck off. Oh. Oh, barely saved it. Get off here. Let's go. Winner. Let's frickin' go. Yeah. Let's go. He beat a future Hall of Famer in a pressure-filled, high-stakes ladder match at the biggest
All right. Here is your winner. Uh, Trey, let's go. All right. Um, what did we just cross off? Oh, star in a WWE action movie. All right. So let's move on. Looks like we're gonna. End, I'm gonna end this video here. Thank you guys for watching this video. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe if you want to see some more WWE 2K20 My Career Mode. So I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.